biggest damage which was done to people of my generation was that, f I don't want to say fear, but that, 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 that feeling of being persecuted anywhere, anytime, by anybody, wherever you look, whoever you looked at may have been a German spy. And this feeling I still have. And it's been a long time. I've been, I've, I've, I've left Czechoslovakia in 39, so it's, it's a long time. But we met other Nazis, we met other people. I remember in, in Nairobi, uh, we met a young man who turned out to be one of the consuls at the German embassy. And I had to go and see them because I had asked for my mother to get, a, to get pensions, and I had to deal with the embassy there. And he was telling me, you know, actually I have seen Jews. I've actually seen some. They were cleaning the, the railway station, and they were, you know, so I've actually seen that there were Jews around. Can you believe it? Was, I mean, I was brought up in an absolutely non-religious, I knew we were Jews, but that's about all there was. No religious upbringing in your life? Not me, but when we were in, in, in Nairobi, and when my mother joined me, I thought I was, it is absolutely the least I can do to educate the children and give them the idea of, of the background and, and where they come from. I, I dream a great deal, and I dream very often about my childhood, about the friends we had, the various people we met on the four continents we lived at. I'm glad I can talk about it, and I'm glad I can talk to you and your friends here because I know, I know it's a receptive audience, and uh, they just want to hear another side, another story, because mine is maybe a little bit different from, from many others. My mother told me about what happened to her in Auschwitz and her whole story once. And she said, I never want to talk, to talk about it again, and she didn't. She came back with a damaged heart. And uh, after she was here two years, two years, she died. Mm -hmm. I feel really, uh, I have fulfilled my mission in life. Maybe I'm the last of a, of a generation of my whole family. Liebschitz family, there's not, nobody but me, nobody at all. And unfortunately, I have nobody I can ask about family background.